video today I am opening up my Foxy Fix mystery order on camera I just got this about five seconds ago in the mail ran in pulled out my tripod and just knew I had to film it so um, I'm going to do this really quickly this is actually an order that came in a little bit ago a few days ago and it's from um, the inserts that I ordered so I'll just show these to you really quick um, if my cat moves out of the way there we go messing with the lighting sorry about that I'm so excited you guys also this packaging like oh look at that stamp is it a stamp I think it's a stamp it's gorgeous I love it okay so I did pick up a couple of um, inserts and dashboards or not dashboards pockets I can't talk you guys I am literally so excited for this um, because it's mystery sale, some things are clear. It's clearance. Some things could be imperfect. Um, so I did get um, dashboards, so I can have. Um, I got four dashboards. Um, whoops, a little close in. So these are just the number two sized. Um, like plasticky ones so I'll probably use um, some scrapbook paper I have from Michaels already to uh, fill that in and then I did get pockets as well just in case you never know what you're gonna get I've been stalking the Facebook group watching everyone open up their orders and mine is finally here I can't believe it and it was in it was listed as in transit to destination for a really long time um, and it hadn't been scanned for like three days I want to say so I was really nervous it was lost but here it is it's the golden envelope I'm gonna unbox it I have no idea what's in here um, I really don't know what to expect feels kind of thin I'm not really sure if it's loaded or not Ooh! oh my goodness so I got <gasps> you guys I'm so excited this is my first Foxy ever. Oh my goodness. So it looks like it is a single strap. That's okay. I think you can fit like three inserts in one of these. I got it with stitching. So that's really exciting. Um, and a silver fox embossed on the spine. If you can see that. Oh my goodness. It's so pretty. And this size notebook is perfect <gasps> look at it oh I wonder what this is this is like a really thick sturdy leather <gasps> I'm so excited to play with this and then I also got a card holder which oh my gosh that's super exciting too that's just a freebie that they sent and this one's super thick too so I'm gonna figure out something for this for sure oh my gosh look how pretty it is I'm totally okay that it's a single. I've heard you can still fit a few, um, a few inserts in here with this. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait to put this to good use. Oh, wow, it's beautiful. And it has foil embossing on the side. Like that's really more than I could have ever asked for. Oh my goodness. Well, that's all I got for uh, this mystery order. If it'll, sorry, there we go. Uh, if it'll focus. So thank you so much for watching. I cannot wait to put this baby together. Oh, I missed my leather sample too. Ooh, this one's so pretty. I think this is the one I got in my, is this the one I got in my, oh no, I got, so I got this bright pink one and then I got this um so I think this one um is is this mochi I want to say this is sugar mochi and this I think is like is it grapefruit or something like that I'm not sure I will put this on the Facebook page and ask but this is what I got I am so excited I will post a setup video I got a lot of stuff to put in it so I'm really excited to get started and um, I guess I'll have to order a jump band I don't really know how to do that so I'm gonna head over to the Facebook group and ask thanks you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time bye Hi guys, I just wanted to come on here and do a really quick flip through video of how I have set up my traveler's notebook for the time being. This is the one that I got in the mystery sale. It is a single and I think we determined that it is a um, 
Wanderlust Licorice. The leather is super, super thick and sturdy, which I really, really love. I'm already looking at getting one for work for next year, just so I can have everything all in one place. Obviously, I would get a lot bigger size. This is a number two, so this is a pocket notebook um, and really teeny, and it has this silver embossed fox on the side, which I love. Um, so I kind of just um, tried some stuff out and stuck some stuff in it and wanted to show you what I uh, did with it. So um, the first thing is my charm here. This is from Hello Simple Paper. Let me, it's probably not going to zoom in, but it is an iridescent mermaid charm, which I absolutely love. I think it's so pretty. I love the way it looks against the black just really, really nice. Um, and so that's the charm that I put on here. I haven't put one on the spine yet. I haven't decided if I'm going to or not. So this is the front cover and then let's get into it. So everything I got for this notebook, I pretty much got at Michael's. I got a couple pockets, which you will see. I'm attaching this portion of the video to my unboxing of the golden envelope itself. So you open the notebook and there is a cat paper clip. I have no idea where this came from. I want to say that I bought it from Willow Fields a long time ago, um, but I am not 100% sure. And then I have a little um, Instax picture of Eric and my dog Anaya while we were out hiking one day, which just turned out super, super cute and fun. I have a sheet of vellum that I got at Michael's, and the only thing that's negative about this vellum is that it's kind of glittery, even though... Like it's gold foil, but there's definitely some glitter on it. So it, you can kind of see, I don't know if you can see on here, but it definitely transferred some of that glitter onto the leather, which is a little bit disappointing, but you know what? That's okay. It gives it character. So, and it comes off pretty easily. So I have this sheet of vellum and it does wrap around to the back. So if anyone has any suggestions, I feel like it slides around a lot. And I don't know if it's because I'm not really supposed to, um, put the vellum around my whole set of inserts. I don't really know. So let me know if you have any comments. This is obviously the first time I've ever set up a traveler's notebook, so I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, so suggestions and comments are appreciated. The next thing I have is this Foxy Fix dashboard and I filled it with Michael's scrapbook paper. Um, this was um, like a summer booklet that I got for $5.99. Normally they retail for $20, so it was a great sale. So I put these pineapple ones in here. I have an Annie Plans printables in, uh, insert in here, and then a Hello Simple Paper purple mermaid clip up top. It's not going to focus on that, I don't think. Maybe. There we go. Um, so a uh, clip up top just to mark to June because that is where we are. Um, so I'm going to use this, I'm kind of used, decided to use this as um, an addition to my budget planner just because this is a lot easier to tote around in my purse, throw it in my bag and keep track of purchases and, and expenses that way. So then you have the back side of that dashboard. I put a piece of white polka dot acetate in here. Also from Michaels, I just thought it was super cute um, and a good way to separate, separate out the inserts. Um, so the next insert I have here is a debt repayment, um, which I have yet to fill out because I wanted to do a flip, for, flip through first. Um, so I have these debt repayment inserts in here. And then this is the elastic that came with the Foxy Fix, I just used a um, hair band to make a jump band for the other two. My only question is um, it sticks out a lot on the side. It, there's a lot of overhang and I'm wondering how I can prevent that from happening because this middle one definitely pushes out a lot, like a lot in the middle. So I don't know what I did wrong or if I can do anything differently when it comes to that. So I have that. Um, like these pink and purple waves, which I thought were super cute, and then my debt repayment inserts, and then you have the backside of the white polka dot acetate. Next, I put pink flamingo acetate in on top of pink flamingo scrapbook paper. I just thought it was super cute and too adorable not to. And then I have a lists printable in here with a turquoise Hello Simple paper clip as well. 
and um, I'm going to be using this insert to keep track of coupon codes because I always forget coupon codes. I always forget to put them in or maybe I look up one but I realize I had another that was maybe better that I should have used. So I'm going to go ahead and put all of these uh, coupon codes in so I can keep track of them. Uh, for when I order stickers again once I'm off my nose bend and then I have that back of that dashboard with the flamingo paper again um, The acetate and then this vellum back here And then I just stuck an Erin Condren compliment card in the back pocket So this is my very first setup. I'm sort of new to this, but I'm really excited to start using it I think it just is so I don't know, it's so functional and customizable, so I'm really excited to get into the world of Foxy's and hopefully not get super addicted and just buy 10 million of them. So that's everything for this video, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!